All right. Here's what we have. So what are we explaining today? So as part of the outtakes, we wanted to talk about and show your three-year love puzzle to Lexi Raven. Which we talked, yeah, we talked about in the show. We've talked about this a number of times on the show. This is a photo album I used. I don't know if people, you know, maybe thought it was bullshit or what man would do that for his woman. Right. Well, Oscar Spector is the man that would do a three-year love puzzle yeah. for his little lady. Now, we're going to show you everything. Um, we have it kind of spread out here. We're also recording for YouTube so you guys can see this stuff. Um, it is... It's fucking crazy. Mm -hmm. uh, every man is being shamed right now because they don't do stuff like this for their women. <laughs> uh, I know I feel guilty for never having done anything like this for Katie Knight. Right. Uh, but this is incredible. So tell us, just give us a little brief backstory just to catch people up if they haven't heard this before. So again, this is a three-year puzzle that you were putting Lexi through. Yes. Correct. Yes. Well, here's a quick recap. I'm just showing you the the face of everything. I'm kind of like showing my um, <clears throat> my romantic side that I keep well hidden from everyone. Now I'm showing it to everyone. Um, okay. So these are three uh, letters. Actually, there was a fourth, I believe, but it had nothing on it. It was. It came. Uh, this idea originally came from this uh, bigger basket gift I gave her, full of makeup stuff that she wanted and lipstick and things that you know she likes. And I gave her this thing, this first letter. Which has nothing on it, nothing beyond what is written, and it was written by uh, with a pen, old-fashioned like ink and quill pen that wow. she gave me, and I used it all to write all this. No kidding. Right. So it was actually kind of hard. You see all the splotches, me fucking up there. See me fucking up there. See these yeah. are all mistakes because I don't know how to write the old-fashioned way. Now the crinkly yellowness is that? Yeah, I bought, I bought papyrus or pa like old paper-looking paper from um, Amazon. I think they call it papyrus. Papyrus? Papyrus? I don't, I don't know. know. Might be my Mexican is there. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not 100% not Papel? sure. Papel? So I wrote, I wrote this to her, but she didn't know this letter existed because I told her when I gave her this letter, I told her that this one was the second one. So I was like, where's the first one? And she found it later on in the basket, hiding underneath the lining. Of the and, makeup basket. Right. And underneath the basket, I don't have the basket on me. And underneath the basket had like an old Wicca like love spell for her to keep her safe, things like that. I, she I, likes that stuff too. I, I drew some stuff for her on there and shit like that. So I had that hidden for a whole year before she found it. And you were able to keep your cool for a year? The whole time. Oh my God. The whole time. And then, um, so I gave her this one. I think in here, you can't really read it, but it says that there's a limerick on this thing and she can't read it yet, but there's a limerick on here. If we do, yes, go ahead. This, I don't know if they can see it. I hope they can. Could you see it on the phone? I'm gonna see if I could. Uh, how do I? Um, yeah, I think they can. You wanna, yeah. If you want to hit the lights, it's right next to you. Yeah, they see it. They see it. They can okay. see. It. Yeah. Look at this. Look so at this. I wrote this like a little all, love little merc on here. This is all written in the invisible ink. Right. Right. Lime juice ink or something like that. And in here. This one, you go, we'll shine it over here too. I wrote like, this is like a little funny thing I wrote, like little puzzle things that all have like little smatterings of it. See right here's oh, the yeah, answer. Yeah. Uh, these are smatterings of hopefully to get her to like start thinking of the idea that this is written in black ink or like a glow in the dark ink. Back here, I think there's something too. Yeah, oh, there's a whole letter. Oh my God. This is the whole letter. It was hard to write it because I had to hold the light when I did it. Yeah. And it was uh, kind of hard. Because I don't have like a, And it's still in the quill pen? Yes. Wow. Yes. See, I got better at it. See, no splotches on this one? Yeah, on this you're side? good. You're good. I did way better on this one. Um, so, anyway, that's the nutshell of how this began to let her to say that there was this puzzle that she had to solve. All these letters say it. Puzzle to open this. So, here's that cryptex we've talked about on the show. You want to hold it? Yeah. And if you... I mean, this thing has some serious... Syria. If you hit someone with this, you could kill someone with this. Yeah, thing. probably. Yeah. And so, so all of this, and we're going to get to the pictures in a moment right. too. All of this led to this. Right. Correct. Yes. And this contained. Do you want? Do you want to tell what it contained? Or oh yeah, like a little ring, like a little promise ring. It was a so this isn't even a wedding ring, folks. Nope. He went. Through, he went through all this trouble for a promise ring. Imagine yeah. when they get married. Yeah, Holy promise shit. ring. It had uh, her is, favorite uh, o a stone, which is opal. It was an opal crazy. ring. Yeah. Opal ring, she likes that crap. 
I'm not insane. So that. somehow these letters, and here we're going to get to the photos next, they led to a code for this right. cryptex. Right. These are all like little, um, like, no, little, to see little this Polaroid list. sticker photos. Show that us, I'm not going to show you. I'll show us one. Show I'll us show one. show you one. See? This me. Dumbass. That's me. This is one of the pictures. None of them are naked or anything, but just embarrassing. Okay. And I, and I wrote here first, and then 22 later. Watch, watch last. this, guys. Watch this. What? Look at the dedication this guy went through. Look at this. I don't know if this is dedication, love, or insanity. I don't know what it is, but it's incredible. Look at this. Yep. All of them have something. All are numbered that way. These are already numbered appropriately. Man. And everything means something, and they all have different things. They all have Man, is that cool? <laughs> six-letter words, which is what this requires Six letter word to requ requires that too. For so, the so I had her right for the cryptex, which is why they're all like six letters. And, and by the way, I'm using a like a, this this kind of high powered black light. Yeah, this is what you gave her. Yes, I did. To a while later too. I gave it to her out early the, this year. This tiny little thing. Yeah. She would have to go with this little pen light. Yep. To read. I made this it stuff. difficult for oh her. Oh my god, dude. Yep. You are a pimp. <laughs> you are a pimp. <laughs> Well, thank you. Anyway, so I did all this, okay. and it, so yep. the actual puzzle, how it solved, use a big one for this. Big one, yep. yeah, got big it. One for this. Got it. So the way it worked is that if you look at the ones that are are not blue, so the red ones. Oh my! It's color coded too. Yeah, it's color coded. Oh my! Okay, so here, okay, so that looks blue to me. That's maybe? blue. Yeah, that's blue. Or that's more blue right there. No, uh, that's blue. That's still blue. Right here, this one. See right there? So These are blue. pink. Yeah. Or red, pink yeah. red. So the ones that are pink red are the actual things to lead her to the to the word. The word right now, I'll just tell you right now, is divine. So the the word to open the cryptex is divine. Was divine, yeah. So divine. through all of this stuff, right? She had to figure out the, the word divine. The way you figure it out is that if you go back to up here, these two right here, see the number? It says lovely. It has a number on it. What number is it? Four. Uh, four. And this one is what? Five. Yeah. So those will include the the that's the D and the E. And divine, and over here, see it has two, nature and up in this one for some reason it has two words in one photograph, and it's number nine. Yeah, that's for the eyes, the two eyes and divine. See, how do you spell divine? D I V I N E. Okay, okay. Right, so that's two eyes, right? Uh -huh. And this yeah, one yeah, over yeah. here, the zenith over here, fourteen down here. Oh yeah, that oh, one too. Oh okay, there's zenith. Yeah. Well yeah, that will be for the V, right? And up here is for the the N. And that spells out divine. So she would write all this down on a like if 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 zero is if if one is a, and you go all the way down to twenty two right to z or twenty four to z, then you would know which picture is what alphabet, and that's how she can spell divine. You know, now it was like a simple thing, but yeah, <laughs> she could not figure this out. So. so did she? So I guess the big question is, did she? Well, I'm showing you this divine. because she did figure it out, but she figured it out by just. Ran randomly she just put that word in there are you serious yes she did were you pissed no i was no i mean i, I definitely did not expect that but like she was like saw all these and there are kind of like synonyms for that she was like what's the one word that he hasn't put in here that would be like positive the way this is or mostly is and she was able to figure and she it figured it out just by that so in a way you yeah. led her to the word yeah i still took it two three years but yeah <laughs> three years yeah and well. you kept your composure for three years yep I would have lasted probably two days. Two days? No joke. <laughs> I would have lasted two days. If I would have known that ring was, or the first, what was in the basket again? In the lining of the basket? The first love letter? The first love, if I would have known that was sitting there and I walked past it more than like three times in two days, <laughs> I would have said, what the fuck is wrong with you? Why, can't you Why don't you look basket? at things? <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I think. Uh, now, what? okay, so uh, just to backtrack a little bit, what did the pictures mean i know you don't want to show all the pictures because some of them are really oh no the pictures were just a cute thing so i gave her for her birthday i think this was i don't remember anymore because i gave it to her for different things like one of these letters was for valentine's day one of them was for christmas her birthday our anniversary wow. all a combination of events over the past three years so it's not like back to back either i skip one like i'll skip valentine's this year and i'll give it to her on you know things like that yeah yeah so like uh the pictures were one of the last things i gave her I gave her the pictures and this last Cryptics. because to tell her that, okay, you have every, I told her when I gave her this, that uh, you have everything you need to solve it now. Wow. And uh, there should be no excuse. I said that 
So, so I guess the the ultimate question then is, what was her reaction? Oh, when she finally got to unlock. Well, she well this she bad boy. Well, she didn't solve it like in front of me. She solved it at home. Oh, right. So I wasn't like with her, but she was. She immediately Facetimed me and was like freaking out and was telling me like, I figured it out, I figured it out. Like, how, like how did you figure it out? How did you know the alphabet? Like, no, I just guessed the word. I'm like, oh, come on. <laughs> You know, did she like, like the ring? Yeah, of course she did. She's wearing it now. Awesome. Yeah, as far as I know, I'm I I'm speechless know. with all this. I mean, yeah. one genius to figure it out. Two, the fact that you were able to com- keep your composure. And three, just uh, doing this for somebody. Sometimes I almost told her, and she can't stop asking questions. She's so bad. She's <laughs> she does. She wants to know so bad. She keeps asking me all the time. Wow. All the time she kept asking me. Are you gonna do this again? Oh yeah, just just different. You know. Good for you, man. Yep. Keep love alive. Keep it interesting. Yeah, so it's. Uh, I think that's all I have, though. Yeah, I don't have the basket. So, yeah. yeah anyway. And there we go, listeners. We promised we would show them, so this is uh, yep. showing them. He wasn't bullshitting. He really did all this work. Mm-hmm. Good for you, man. Proud of you. Aw, thank you.